Okay, so we're here outside the theater. We've got our signs. We actually went inside and uh, talked to the, the people in the theater, the people that are working, and uh, we told them what we're gonna be doing. We said we will be out here peaceably protesting. We told them why. We said that we don't like that their uh, movie for the Christmas uh, celebration is gonna be this. And he said something to the effect that well, this isn't part of the Christmas celebration. I said, yes, we saw in the newspaper that this is part of the Christmas celebration. He said, oh, well, we've been showing it all week or something to that effect. Like, oh, it's no big deal. But um, anyway, so we told them what we we're doing and they just kind of were like, oh, okay, whatever. And so we just uh, want to make sure everybody knows that we're doing this very peaceably. We're just going to stand here and hold our signs. That's my sign. And that's her sign. Her sign is the powerful one because it's got scripture. And uh, no, we're here about an hour early, so uh, nobody's coming yet. But uh, typically this is about when they start to show up. So we're just going to uh, stand here and hold our signs and talk to anybody that wants to talk to us about it. So um, we're expecting people to show up. That might be somebody now. So anyway, um, hope everybody's keeping us in their prayers. Is that the Grinch? It is the Grinch. <laughs> I just wanted to give everybody a little update. We just, we finished our protest. It's now 7.30. Doesn't look like anybody else is coming. I'm happy to report a few things. We had some good productive interactions with some of the people going in. And uh, we talked to one of the ladies that had to do with the sponsoring of this event. And uh, she said that they felt really bad once they realized what kind of a movie it was. I wish they would have stopped it still, but she said that they were under contractual obligation to show it. <sighs> anyway, they were, she said she felt really bad about it. And uh, anyway, we had uh, some actual, we had some young kids talk to us and engage about it. So I think, you know, it uh, opened some minds. Kareen says she saw one car pull in, was reading our signs and left. So we may have had uh, somebody not come, but uh, here's one thing I want to show you. If you come out here. Okay. Um, so I just wanted to show you, we, we lived here last year. Actually, this was our last, uh, oh no, this wasn't the last day. But anyway, we were living here last year and they had, when they did this movie, um, they had, the streets were lined with cars. And I want to show you, if you could step onto the street, do you see this side of the street? Hardly any cars. And um, so we got here earlier and, uh, the cars down there are actually for the Mexican restaurant because we didn't see any of those come down to the movies. And um, so if you look down this street too, so the last time we came, there were cars lined up and down the street. This year, there's hardly any. So we're happy to report that a lot of people didn't, didn't come out to the movies. And uh, we're really pleased with that. Um, so there's a lot less kids that are gonna get this propaganda. So thanks for those that prayed for us. Uh, we we're really happy that we came and did this and uh, we think it had some productive effect and we know that God was glorified ultimately and uh, we actually even talked with one young lady about her salvation briefly and uh, hopefully that planted a seed so uh, anyway just wanted to let you know how it, how it turned out and we're going to leave this wonderful Bible verse behind in case anybody needs to read it